Welcome back to All Access Cape Cod. We took a break from the winter weather last month to visit the Cape and Islands Orchid Society's annual orchid show. Now all of these beautiful flowers were grown right here on Cape Cod. So let's take a look. If you can grow African violet, then you can grow an orchid. If you can grow basil, you can grow an orchid. The theme of the show this year is Victoriana, and the goal of the show is to introduce orchids to people as a plant material that they can grow in their home. And we picked the Victorian theme because that was one of the major heydays of collecting orchids and growing orchids in the world. We meet once a month and talk about orchids and have programs by where we have speakers that come from all over the world, believe it or not, to talk about their particular interest in orchids and help us to learn to grow orchids as well. I have murdered a lot of orchids. I still murder orchids. I have a, I, we actually have a little, I have a pot about yay big that's my dead pot, my dead tag pile. So I will tell you that um, you have no choice, you will kill a few plants, maybe even hundreds. This particular type is a, is a Phalaenopsis, and this is considered the best beginner orchid to grow. And that's because, two reasons. One, it likes indirect light, so it's a coffee table plant. It doesn't want, to be in a south facing window, it wants to be in east or west bright indirect light. So most of us have that in our homes hopefully. And the other thing that is great about it is, is this inflorescence or spike as it's called lasts for many, many months. Okay, and so it, it's a lot of bang for the dollar that you spend. And so you know longevity wise, you know, something that blooms if you cared for it well for six months is a fantastic thing. We invite you to join and we'd love to have some new young people. It would, it's a great hobby. Uh, it really truly has been a fun thing. Get a chance to meet all kinds of really wonderful people from all over the world. The Cape and Islands Orchid Society welcomes anyone interested in growing these beautiful flowers. And unlike in the past, they are inexpensive and available at most nurseries. For more information, you can visit their website. Now stay tuned for an interview with Pam Kruger, a Cape native and the newest contributor here at All Access Cape Cod.